Unfortunately, we often get lowball offers on our NFTs in OpenSea. Check out this cool looking Lazy Lion, for example. The current price is 2.1 Ethereum, but if you scroll on down to the offers, you'll notice that we've got an 8.4 along with a 0 0.001. Today, I'm going to show you how to set the minimum offer amounts on OpenSea so that you can weed out the low offers. This will also keep you safe from scammers who put in offers using another currency. So imagine someone putting in an offer for, let's say, 2.1 USD instead of 2.1 ETH. Sadly, this does happen, and of course, there is a significant difference between US dollars and Ethereum. So let's head on up to our profile picture up in the top right hand corner, and then head on down to settings. You are going to receive a signature request from your MetaMask extension. Go ahead and hit sign. From there on the left hand side, click on offers. This is where we're going to set up all of our minimum offer amounts. So if we scroll down, we can see all of the different collections that we have in our wallet. The list will display both your visible and hidden collections. But let's go ahead and start setting our minimum offers. Now, the great thing is OpenSea will show you the current floor price. So that helps with determining the minimum offer amount. As you can see, Lazy Lions has a floor price of 1.4. And let's say we don't want to accept an offer that's under, I don't know, like a 1.3, for example. We can go ahead and set our minimum offer maybe to like a 1.29. And if you want, you can actually skip some of these. You don't have to do every single field if you don't want to. So we'll head on down to the Psychedelics Anonymous uh, Genesis collection. And it's interesting because you can actually put an amount that's higher than the floor. So if the floor is 3.45, but you're thinking, you know what, I don't want to sell these until the floor hits 5 Ethereum. You can put the amount for, let's say, 4.9. 4.99. And if we move on down, we can continue on with the rest. There we go. We've got several amounts in place. Once you're happy with the numbers, go ahead and click on the save button at the bottom. And that's it. You're all set and ready to go. If you found this tutorial helpful, please do give it a like and subscribe. And be sure to check out nftsweep.io for the latest in NFT news as well as other tutorials.